Hi everyone, welcome to the 16th lecture of Ansible series and in this lecture we will discuss about raw module. So if you remember in my conceptual section of Ansible we discussed about this a bit where to interact with manage node from the controller engine we need python on the system on the manage node it's always better to have python on the manage node what if python is not available onto the manage node we cannot use ansible no it's not that the fact we can still use ansible with the help of raw module now that's the syntax like ansible give the host name hyphen m for the module raw hyphen a for the argument and whatever operation that you want to perform raw module overcome limitations of the command module obviously it's like i'm not supposed to install python on my system on my managed node how can i use ansible to manage that particular server let's use raw module you don't have to worry about hey i cannot use ansible to manage all the servers which is not having python okay so let me exit out of the presentation before going through all the differences let me show you a real quick example so i already have a server created which is not having a python running on this system now command is ansible then the host name hyphen m for the module which is raw then hyphen a for the argument and in our last lecture we installed git right let's check the version of git enter so we are getting a git version 1.8.3.1 this was the same version that we installed in our last lecture and sh shared connection is closed after giving us the response so that's how you interact with all the system which is not having a raw module let's go back to the presentation again and we'll do a quick look about the differences between command shell and raw now command is basically within same shell you are running up a command on your remote host and getting out the information over there right shell is basically opening up a new shell again running the same command same command which means like running the uh, operation to fetch out the information from the manage host but the difference between shell and command here is a new shell gets open but in command we can use the same shell to get the response raw module is basically low level command where interpreter is missing on the target host like python in our case a common use case is like installing a python right you don't have to worry about installing a python it's better to have python on the system because as an example let's say we have a again ansible managed node right this is a managed node and this is our controller engine right now let's say if you want to copy something out of uh, managed node to controller engine so you can use copy sorry uh, from uh, manage engine to controller we are basically fetching out it fetching out the information so you can use fetch if you are pushing out something then obviously you can use copy that we have done in our uh, demo lab for the ad hoc command but let's say if python is not there over here then you cannot interact you cannot use copy you cannot use fetch you have to write some out of the box functionality which is again it's not that hard to write we can still write to fetch out or copy or do certain operation but it's always better if you have a python then it's easy to use copy command it's easy to use fetch command instead of writing everything from scratch right so that's what raw that's the difference basic difference it can be used to launch scripts for executing a simple command that's what command is it can be used if you want to execute more complex command as an example commands concatenated with the pipe so let's say if you are combining multiple commands into one then obviously it's it becomes a shell script command is basically where you are launching your script or executing a simple simple commands right like a doc one liner command module where we combine the commands right then raw module is basically not used for all other cases where command and shell is suggested obviously if if uh, we are supposed to use shell or we are supposed to use command i will not going to prefer to use raw so that's what the big difference over here is as an example like you are catting up a file like cat some file dot text that's what command is shell where uh, you are instructing it cat and then grip something within that file 
and within raw again uh, i i know only the syntax over here which is basically ansible hostname hyphen m raw and whatever the operation you want to perform so that's what ansible raw module is you don't have to worry about to have python on the system it's good to have python but let's let's uh, not deep dive over there so that's the syntax that you can use play out, play around with the raw module try uh, play around with some of the uh, uptime git or whatever packages you are installing just try it out and please out a comment in comment section share your experience i'll see you in next lecture have a nice day bye, -bye.